Step one, get your fabric, fold it in half, see? Fold it in half, fold it in half. This is the outer piece, this is the inner piece. Because I don't wanna have to cut twice, I just put it on top of each other. I get the iron to straighten it out a little bit so I can handle it better. And what we're gonna do is, we're gonna put our pattern. So we're gonna choose our pattern. I have two pattern. I have this one and I have this one. This one is this shape, right? That's that shape. That's this one. And then this shape is this one. This one is that. This one is this shape. I'll be using this one. So I put my pattern somewhere. I figure out where I want it. I put it there. And I'm going to get my scissors and I'm just going to cut around the pattern and I'll be right back. This is That's not really step two, but let's just call it step two. So step two, we cut our fabric with our pattern and now we're ready to sew. So this is the pattern. This is the inner piece, the liner. And this is the outer piece. Also, I have a, what do you call this? I don't know, a filter? I don't know why I call it a filter. But anyway, the fabric wasn't enough. I'ma just cut on them pieces so I can make it all to the shape of the pattern. This is a filter. Nothing can go through this. So I'm gonna put this there too. So that's our next step. Okay, step three. We went ahead and pin the filter onto the liner and then we pin the right side together same for the outer side of the mask we pin the right side together so we're gonna go ahead and stitch this all the way around make sure we double stitch at the ends and we're gonna do the same thing for this one and we'll be right back. I think this is step four. So step four, okay, we already, see, we already sewed this part down and we did the same for this here. This is the filter. See how nice that is? So this is the filter. This is the inside of the mask. All right. So what we're gonna do now, oh my God, I can't, I don't, how do I hold this camera? What we're gonna do now is we're gonna open this and we're gonna put the outer part, we're gonna put them together facing each other and kind of pin it down so it will stay in place so we're gonna stitch the whole thing all the way around all the way around make sure it's in line up properly and we're gonna stitch it all the way this we will cut a little piece off but i'll show you that when i'm done so i didn't go ahead and sew it yet i just went ahead and cut off and cut off these parts so i cut off because it was equal to that so i cut off this and this not the outer piece the outer piece stays See, only these two pieces, only the filter and the inside of the mask. So I did it on this side and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do it on this side. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and cut off about that much. Hey okay, guys, we are back with the almost finished product. So what I just did was to sew both parts together. I stitch it all the way around there and all the way down here. 
So now, our next step, what we need to do is we need to turn this inside out. Okay, and then we're going to push these, the edges, we're going to push these edges apart, and then we're going to have that, and we're going to iron this down. And make sure we iron the whole thing and steam it so it stays in place, steam it properly. Make sure the edges are properly, and I'll be back. When it I'm done. doesn't look all iron to me. Okay, so I just steam this so it will keep its shape. And what I did was I steamed it, then steam that, then steam it again oops and now i'm gonna go to the machine and just stitch here and stitch over here and i'll be right back okay we're back with the final product see oops I put my label on there, of course. This is the inside. This is the outside. So due to the high demand of elastic, I have no elastic, but you get the drift. The elastic runs through here, or we can run it through here, all the way through here, and then you know what I'm saying. So that's the finished product.